So the guys at Armadillo Tech reached out to me and asked me if I wanted to look at their Galaxy S10 Vanguard series case. Well I'd already looked at the Note 9, so hell yeah! But what did I think of it for the S10? Well I'll let you know after this. So, yeah, as I said, back in September, I reviewed the Vanguard series from Armadillo Tech for the Galaxy Note 9, and I seem to set off a bit of a trend by being the first person to throw the Galaxy Note 9 while wrapped in this case, like this. Yeah. As you can see, they're back with cases for the S10. They come in multiple colours. I have here today the red, the white, and the blue. They were kind enough to send me three different cases. So, this way you get to see what they look like in different colours. They are actually really nice, so let's have a look at the packaging. The packaging's improved this year, not that there was anything wrong last year, but this year you can see it's got the military grade, Armadillo Tech wrote on the top, Vanguard series, Armadillo Tech wrote on the side. Flip over to the back tells you that this is the Vanguard series with the military grade rugged protection, and it really does have some really rugged protection. Designed in Texas, made in China. These guys are out of Texas, let me tell you. Real good guys as well. So yeah, packaging is really good. Let's crack this thing open though. Let's get to the guts of uh, what we're here for. So we'll pull out the packaging and as you can see it's sat inside the clear plastic. Pull out the case and underneath that, and I think this is a really nice touch, with every case they send out they have actually handwritten a letter to the customers to explain about how they're a smaller company and why they are where they're at, they are at now and things like that. There's even errors on the letter, I just think it's a, it's a nice human touch. As you take off the back of the case from the packaging you get the it's like a business card that folds out, tells you contact them if you have any issues. At the front, like a business card, gives you the Armadillo Tech website. Then on the inside, gives you installation instructions and tells you there's a video on their website, which I'll show you as well, and kickstand instructions. It also has where they donate to charity. They always donate to UNICEF. Always. Good guys. Anyway, so let's talk about the case. It's really sturdy, really strong. If anything, it might feel a little bit more sturdy than the Note 9 case. There's no flex really in it. You'd have to really, really flex it. The, the stand isn't flimsy whatsoever either. So, you know you've got some really quality protection. The front frame works just like it did on the Note 9 too. Clips on the front of the phone, and then you put the phone into the actual case. I'll show you that. So, Grab your phone, pretty simple. You see, I've got a regular Galaxy S10 Plus. We grab the front frame, make sure that the USB and the 3.5 jack port are at the bottom. Just push around, it'll fit onto the phone and then it'll sit kind of flat. There's a ridge inside, it'll sit flat on the face of the phone. Then just grab the frame with the phone. Don't push on the phone because it'll come out, but just push into the corners of the frame and your phone will flip in, it'll just sit inside the case, you'll hear it, it kind of clips in a way and that's the, the rubber seal around the side clipping around the front frame, then just put your hands around it, make sure that the rubber's equally there and there you go, on in no time, real good fit, look good. So let's talk about that stand, so you flip up the stand and you'll see there's a little leg underneath, what you do you pull that leg out as far as it'll go to the very edge that will stop the stand from closing on you so when you want to put your phone down in that mode for media mode let's say it's not gonna you know shut the slightest bang isn't gonna make a problem or anything like that so whilst the phone's in the case it does look great it really does look good everything fits perfectly it's just like a Samsung case but it's not it's by these guys at Armadillo Tech it, I prefer it to the official Samsung rugged case by far. I think it feels better in hand. Everything's just right on it. And it's not heavy either. It's very lightweight. And it also isn't very bulky. All the buttons work great. All the flaps are where they should be. And like I say, even when in stand mode, it doesn't look like... Some of these phones look like it's going to fall over at any time. This one doesn't. So how easy is it to take this off? Well, it's pretty easy. It's not meant to be easy. Like, oh, it's just going to fall off. So what you do... You get your finger in and you lift up on the rubber panel and you pull that away from the front frame. Once you get enough of that away, you can get your fingers underneath the phone, not the front frame, make sure you grab hold of the phone and just pull away like this from the case. All you do, peel it away, bang, there it is, it's out of the back of the case. And then you just push on the phone from the frame, make sure you've got hold of it tightly and the frame comes off, no marks whatsoever left on your phone. 
I'll show you again how easy it is to put on. This time I'm going to put it on via the bottom first. So grab the phone, grab your frame, make sure your ports are lined up, feel around, make sure it's totally flat, make sure it's all secure in there, make sure your ports, see how they line up. You're going to grab the phone case, you're going to then put the port end in first, and then you're going to, what you do with your thumbs, you just clip the corners in. Clip, clip, done. That's it. And as you can see, you just feel around the phone, make sure the ceiling has gone all the way around. Done. No problem. Close all your ports, fits perfectly. Blue is my favourite, because obviously I've got a blue phone, and if you've been watching my channel for a while, my favourite colour is blue. Anyway, so yeah, these are a really, really great looking case. I love them. I loved them on the Note 9, and I love them even more for the Galaxy S10 series. They are really high quality for not a lot of money. For what you pay, you're getting an awful lot. I'll leave a link down in the bottom to their Amazon. Go get it.